Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Windows 11 lets you download apps for your computing devices from an improved Microsoft Store. You must be signed into your computer using an online account like a Microsoft account or a work or school account to download apps from the Microsoft Store. To download an app from the Microsoft Store once you have signed in using an online account, click the Microsoft Store icon in the taskbar to open the Microsoft Store app. Alternatively, click the Start button in the Windows taskbar to show the Start menu, Click the All Apps button in the upper right corner of the Start menu to show an alphabetical listing of apps, and then click the Microsoft Store app in this list. In the Microsoft Store app, you can browse the available apps to download. You can browse apps by category, or simply review the featured apps that appear. You can click an app shown in the Microsoft Store to read more about the selected app on its app page. To return to the previous page in the Microsoft Store app, click the Back button in the app's upper left corner. To download an app from its app page, click the Get button or click the button that shows the price of the app. You must provide some form of payment to download and purchase paid apps. Paid apps then open a screen where you can confirm the purchasing method or cancel the purchase. Free apps instead begin to immediately download and install themselves on your device. Note that some free apps that offer in-app purchases let you install the app, but you must then make a purchase in the app or use a connected account that has already made a purchase from the app's vendor to use its features. On the app page, be sure to click the links in the Additional Information section before making purchases from the Microsoft Store app so you know the vendor from whom you are making the purchase, the terms of use, and any other important information regarding the app. Note that the apps you buy are licensed, not sold, for you to use. You should always read the terms under the Additional Terms in the Additional Information section from each individual app provider, which may vary. After selecting an app to install, you will see your download and installation information temporarily appear on screen. After your app has been downloaded and installed, a message box will appear on screen informing you of that fact. You can then close the Microsoft Store app window. The Microsoft Store will also automatically provide updates to the apps installed on your computer. To manually check for app updates in the Microsoft Store, click the Library button in the app's nav bar. Then click the Get Updates button at the upper right side of the app window. The listing of apps to update then appears at the top of the list at the right side of the app window. You can then individually install updates for each app listed by clicking its Update button, or click the Update All link above the list to update all the apps listed. To manage the signed in account and its devices, change your payment methods, redeem gift cards or codes, or access the Microsoft Store's app settings, click your account picture in the command bar at the top of the app window. Then select the desired choice from the drop down menu that appears. Selecting the Manage Account and Devices command opens a web page that lets you access the settings for the signed in account and its related devices. Selecting the Payment Methods command lets you access a web page that shows any saved payment method information. Selecting the Redeem Code or Gift Cards command opens a window within the Microsoft Store app so you can enter the gift code or gift card for redemption. Selecting the App Settings command shows the settings for the Microsoft Store app in the Microsoft Store window. This is where you can view the App Updates, Purchase Sign-In, offline permissions, and video autoplay settings, and change them if needed. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.